Hey guys, Joseph here. Have you ever wondered how awesome it would be to have access to whatever your dash cam sees in real time? Something like a live CCTV in your car, which you can instantly access with a touch of a button. Whether you're at home, you're at work, or even out of the country, these are now possible because of this feature we love and use, cloud connectivity. But not all dash cams have this yet, and not all cloud connections are created equal. So in this video, we're going to be diving into the Dashcam brands with cloud services, namely Blackview Cloud and Thinkware Connected, and compare everything in between from compatibility, features, differences, accessibility, and pricing. So let's talk about cloud connectivity overall. Similar to how iCloud works for your Apple devices, Cloud for dash cams refer to the ability of the device to connect to the internet and store files in a virtual server. Footage is instead sent to a secure server run by the dash cam manufacturers themselves. Blackview, for example, they have their servers powered by Amazon Web Services or AWS. And of course, you can connect to that server wherever you are, as long as you have an internet connection. We're glad to witness how dash cam brands are slowly incorporating the cloud features. Some of the brands that we know are Garmin, Nextspace, Blackview and Thinkware, although they are not all the same. Let's take Garmin and Nextspace for example. So for these dash cams, their version of cloud primarily refers to a virtual storage where the footage can be uploaded. So they basically act as a foul vault for your footage. They don't offer any of the cloud features that we'll talk about later, like two-way communications, push notifications, etc., etc. The Amazon Ring Cam that just came out last year has a few more cloud features that's closer to Blackview and Thinkware, but it's still fairly preliminary compared to the two, so we won't go into that today. On the other hand, Blackview and Thinkware delivers way more than just that. So beyond securing your videos, these cloud services enable automatic backup and dash cam setting configurations through the smartphone app or desktop software. They can also keep you in the know by sending real-time notifications when your car detects motion and impact. It works beyond storage too. They also offer convenient features that make Blackview Cloud and Thinkware Connected our leading choice when it comes to cloud. First thing we want to know is obviously the compatibility. Do these cloud services work for all the Blackview and Thinkware dash cams? Nope, they don't. For example, Thinkware Connected only works for the Thinkware Q1000 and the U3000 dash cam. Older models like the U1000 have access to the older Thinkware cloud. Now with Blackview, the DR770X to the 4K dash cams like the DR970X lineup are all compatible with Blackview cloud. All current models except for the DR590 series support the cloud. Next, let's move into the cloud features. The first one we're diving into are the push notifications. For example, you leave your car parked and something hits your car. Both of these are able to notify you with these kind of events through their instant notifications feature. These notifications are gonna provide you with a snapshot of what happened during the incident with a full recorded video viewable on the app all 100% remotely. We noticed that with the Thinkware Connected newly designed app, its home screen already displays the event notifications showing exact number of impacts during parking mode. And that's the catch, only impacts. Unfortunately, at the moment, Thinkware cameras won't notify you of motion around the vehicle while parked. Blackview, on the other hand, can notify you of both impacts and motion while parked. So the point does go to Blackview. Next, let's compare the remote live view feature. Remote Live View is a feature that enables you to check your dash cam footage in real time wherever you are. It instantly has access to your dash cam's view, and we're happy that both Thinkware Connected and Blackview Cloud have this. However, Blackview has added a feature that gives you access not only to what the dash cam sees, but also to whoever is in the car. And that's two-way voice communication. This allows you to communicate with whoever's driving or riding your car. So plus points for safety, Blackview definitely wins in this regard. Next, GPS tracking. Blackview Cloud has GPS tracking where you can instantly visualize on a map your car's location and speed. Blackview has an exclusive fleet tracking service where you can access 90 days worth of GPS data. On the other hand, Thinkware Connected has GPS tracking too and geofencing. 
through this, the Thinkware dash cam will send a push notification through the app if a vehicle enters or exits a pre-selected geographic zone. Still, Thinkware has gone a step further through the vehicle report. You can get a detailed history of where the vehicle has been with months worth of history and information on driving habits. So while Blackview does also have geofencing and driving history, you don't get either on the free plan and only seven days on the $12 a month smart plan. And geofencing is locked behind its fleet subscription starting at $2 USD a month, along with 90 days of driving history. So in terms of vehicle tracking, think we're connected wins. One thing that Thinkware Connected has that Blackview Cloud doesn't is the emergency SOS feature. In an emergency situation, pressing the record button on the dash cam for more than three seconds is gonna send an emergency message to one or more registered contacts. This is gonna instantly inform them about the situation and a 10 second video clip will be uploaded online with a link sent to them via text. And lastly, for Thinkware Connected, it also gathers data and info on your vehicle status. So let's say somebody else is driving your car. This feature helps you check important information like whether the vehicle is parked or driving. You can also check the battery voltage, how long the vehicle has been parked for, and even turn off the dash cam remotely if the battery voltage is low. Now let's move on to a feature that Blackview Cloud does have and the Thinkware Connected app does it, the event map feature. So exclusive for all Blackview dash cam owners, the event map feature combines data from local dash cams with a crowdsourced map to display events such as impacts, heartbreak incidents, and even playback videos. So if you check the Blackview cloud, you're gonna see thousands of icons that are your fellow Blackview dash cam users, keeping you in the know of road incidents. For either brand to connect to the cloud, they're gonna need to be connected to the internet in some fashion. For Thinkware, you're gonna have to rely on an outside Wi-Fi source, like a mobile hotspot in the vehicle. For Blackview Dash Cam, you can connect to an instant mobile hotspot with the CM100G LTE module. With this module, you're gonna need to connect a SIM card into it directly to provide that internet connection. Your Blackview can serve as a mobile hotspot providing wireless internet access to your smartphones, consoles, and even laptops. Alternatively, Blackview has also introduced LTE-enabled dash cams like the Blackview DR770X two-channel LTE. Their LTE-enabled dash cams do take matters one step further by having a built-in SIM card slot. All you gotta do is insert a compatible nano SIM card with an active data plan and your dash cam is ready for always-on cloud connectivity. So of course, one thing we want to know when you're using cloud is whether it's free or not, whether we have to pay one time, big time, or we're getting charged per month. We get it. Nobody likes subscriptions and will avoid it if they can. So luckily, Blackview Cloud has a free tier that should be good enough for most daily drivers. However, if you're managing a fleet, and obviously this is more geared towards businesses, Blackview does offer an exclusive plan that enables you to register up to 999 dash cams while enjoying unlimited access to its features. On the other hand, Thinkware Connected has announced that its cloud features are now free to use forever. Although its features are pretty simple compared to Blackview Cloud, we do appreciate that Thinkware lets its users enjoy the best of its cloud without any additional charges. Still, it's important to note that you will normally be paying monthly for your internet connection method of choice. So both Thinkware Connected and Blackview Cloud are excellent cloud services. However, we think they do excel in different areas. Blackview offers a lot of pros. It's got instant push notifications for impact and motion, GPS tracking, remote live view, auto event upload, two-way communication, driving reports, an event map, and even hassle-free accessibility through its mobile hotspot functions, plug and play LTE module, and built-in LTE for its dash cams. But of course, it comes with a price. Everything does. So unless you are a business owner with a few company vehicles to manage or a fleet manager with an entire fleet to look after, the free plan, in our opinion, is more than enough for your daily commute and road trips. On the other hand, the Thinkware Connected app offers less features such as impact notifications, remote live view, emergency messaging, 
geofencing, and vehicle report. Although quite basic, we love that Thinkware made it available for free. It doesn't offer a plug and play LTE module or dash cams with built-in LTE connectivity. So in other words, Thinkware Connected relies on third-party hotspot devices. So because of that reason, we do think that Thinkware Connected is more suited for tracking the vehicle while it's on the road. To name a winner, it'll have to be Blackview. Their cloud service has been around for many years now and has been our go-to for the cloud. While Thinkware's cloud improvements are definitely a massive step up over previous cloud versions, it's tough to compare how much Blackview has built out for the cloud. They still stay at the top of the dashcam cloud options, but Thinkware Connected can still be a nice addition to a more basic user for everyday needs. And before we let you go, let's check out this question from gd 6 New. This person asks, is having a higher resolution at 30 frames per second better than 60 frames per second at 1080p? If I need to get a clear image of the license plate of a moving vehicle? Great question, pal. The good news is that you get the best of both worlds with the Thinkware U3000. The Thinkware U3000's base resolution is 4K at 30 frames per second, but you can also switch to 2K at 60 frames per second if you wish. Recording in 4K can help in busier, lower speed situations, although choosing the higher FPS can be extremely useful if you need to pause things frame by frame, such as side swipes on the highway. Among all the dash cams, we can also say that the Thinkware U3000 is one of the most reliable when it comes to capturing license plates, thanks to its Sony Starvis 2 sensor. Beyond that, this dash cam also works with Thinkware Connected, so you're gonna enjoy the features we mentioned earlier in the U3000. That's it guys. If you like what you watched, be sure to hit that like and subscribe button on your way out. And if you're planning on getting a dash cam from us, be sure to use exclusive YouTube code BBMC2 at checkout and get 5% off your next dash cam. Thanks for watching.